Dave Palumbo here for Muscle Surfing's Daily. I'm here with my assistant Pablo, and today's video is all about him, not about me. It's about Pablo's top five stakes of Palumbo's Pythons and Boas. This is a hard one for you, huh? It is, it is. It definitely, you have a lot of, I had to put a lot of thought into it because I have so many favorite snakes here, but I think we got it down. All right, let's check a look and see what you like here at Palumbo's Pythons and Boas. <laughs> My number five top snake in this facility is this one. It's a Hypo Ultra Mile Pie. Orange Dream. Oh, Orange Dream. How could you forget the Orange Dream? <laughs> so it's R OD Hypo Ultra Mile or o OD Ultra Glow Pie. And I like this one because uh, I like low whites. I think that it um, showcases the um, the pattern more, and obviously the color. Um, I think this one turned out to be very very nice. I I almost thought there was Enchi in there because it, because it's so low white, but I don't think there's I don't as far as I know unless Ozzy snuck a gene in there without telling me <laughs> one of the parents. <laughs> yeah. I like the pinch head too. <laughs> That's why I'm saying with the pinched head, I'm thinking there might be there might be Enchi in there. Yeah. And this is a little girl, but she's become one of my favorites. Obviously, the top five. All right, so for number four of my top five, this is... This was produced in 2020. 2020, yeah. And this is a... This is the ultraviolet. Oh, the ultraviolet, that's right. Rainbow. Hypo, uh, possible Super Enchi. I think it's one copy of Enchi. I think it's Super Hurricane is what yeah. I think it is. Hypo, Rainbow. And this guy has been changing so much since we uh, since we first patched him out. He's still spectacular. There's so much purple in him, right? Yeah. I mean, have you ever seen a per so much purple in, a, in an older snake either? And he's clean. Yeah. There's not a single speck anywhere like of yeah. darkness. And, and this is why I like the Rainbow because yeah, I like the bananas, but I am not a fan, in my personal opinion, of the uh, of the little spots that they get as they grow. Yeah, uh, those little paradoxes. I mean, you can see all the rainbow swirls too here, yeah. I and mean, for the hurricane swirls, excuse me. Yeah. And on the side of the neck, look how that yeah. pattern. Yeah, that's that's from the uh, the hurricane, definitely. Yeah. And as you pointed out, you know the the hur the rainbows, excuse me, have red eyes too. Yeah. They have like a rubyish eye. It's not really a red, red, like albino eye, but it's definitely got a, a reddish eye. We see it more on some of the other ones we produced this past year, but good pick. It's number four, four, right there. Number four. The ultraviolet. <laughs> All right, so for number three, uh, this is something that we recently hatched here, and it is. A clown, obviously, right? Now, this is what I think it is. Uh, this is a GHI Mojave Super Pastel Pink Stripe. Clown. Clown. <laughs> I think we hit every gene on that one, right? Yes. I think we did. Crazy. That is a crazy, crazy, crazy. And you can see it in the pinstriping, really, it doesn't mess with everything, yeah. right? Yeah. It's wacky. And, and, I want to bring out another one uh, because just to show the contrast. Yeah, to, yeah. And, and not only that because I think that um, it really helps identify. This is what I think is GHI Mojave Pastel Clown. Clown, and you can see the pattern, and which is very similar. But I think that what is breaking up this pattern is the pinstripe. I agree. And that's why you have those all those little they don't even look like alien heads on the top here no no but um they they look like uh i don't know it's just broken up pattern it's definitely a powerhouse for sure genetic powerhouse what we could put else in there that's what we got to figure out in the future absolutely all right so for number two of my top five favorite snakes here at day's facility has to be the sun dragon. It's a bino, a cow blood sun dragon. 
This boy. Hypo blood albino. Call form. Let's bring it over here so the light here. This boy is amazing. We had uh, some nice pictures that I don't know if maybe you can uh, put on the video as a, as, as a photo still. Yeah. But he is super, super bright. Look at that, just look at that eye. <laughs> this is, you're talking about red bowers, right? Yeah. And the pattern is, it's, it's really cool. It goes from, uh, from this kind of like elongated circles and it turns into smaller kind of square ones. I think there's a little, there might be jungle in there too. Yeah. From what, Cause it's possible jungle. You know, Pablo just got into bows recently and man, this is, this is, this is, this will traumatize you when you get in <laughs> with, with a snake like this, right? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs>